Woo. Well, hello everybody, and welcome to Daisy Standalone. It's finally upon us. I woke up this morning, I haven't had my coffee yet, so things are a little bit blurry. I log into Steam, I go to the store page as I always do, and there's this strange thing called Daisy staring at me in the face. I, I was like, I actually left the room, went and had a pee, come back, and just to make sure that it was real. So we're finally here. And the game is incredibly loud. So we're just gonna drop this down a little bit. Not sure they should have had numbers instead of a slider, but that's fine. Uh, that one, that one. Let's go through all the uh, crap. That's completely incorrect. Sorry if everything goes a little bit wonkified with the video as it might. Virtual sync disabled. Textures. i tell you what, we'll just keep everything on default for now because this is a beta. Oh, no, actually this is an alpha, sorry. Call this pre-alpha if you will. So things might get that off. Um, a little bit glitchy. Mouse features off. Aiming dead zone. Keep it to nothing. Acceleration off. Off, I said. Off, off, off. Off. Okay. That's that. I'm pretty sure the controls are probably the same, but enough of this jibber jabber. Let's create a character. No, thank you. No, thank you. Uh, no. There we go. We want to be inconspicuous, so we'll go with green, green. I can't even, I can't even see that rocket. What are you doing to me right now? Can't even read that. I think that might be either brown or black. That'll be fine. Back. What? Well, hang on. How do you? You save. Uh, I'm guessing you can't right now. Let's just go play and hopefully we can get in a server. I don't think there are any servers. Oh. Oh, sorry. I'm an idiot. Right, so we're going to sort the players. Ooh, alright. Let's just jump in the shit. Let's jump in the shit. Where's the connect button? Right. So, the point of this video is to get our feet wet with the game. We're not going to be doing anything serious, we're not going to be trying to play the game properly. Um, we are just going to get used to how everything works, and let's get to somewhere safe because I'm noticing that my buttons have not been carried across, and oh my god, they really need to take mouse smoothing off. How come I can't turn that off? Um, radio, here we go. This is all part of a new game, so please don't get, um, pissed at me. But this is just what we need to do. Alright, well, apparently, there's no switch view button unless that's, okay, so it's been default to that key. I've never liked that key, I used to have it on, um, my mouse. But so it's night time. Apologies for that. So what we'll do is just crank this up just a wee little bit for you guys. I know it looks absolutely terrible. Performance is not bad. I'm getting about 35 to 25. You gotta remember this is early alpha. Early, early alpha. Looks like we're at Belota. I, th I 
think we're at Belota. And yeah, my character did not save, so I am a black woman with short hair. That's fine, I guess. And... I don't know what my inventory key is. It's tab, really? Tab? Okay. So, well, I'm a white woman, so... Hard to tell. I feel worn out. Well, shit, love. Don't we all? So, uh, right off the bat... Graphically, the game looks sort of like the same, but maxed out graphics, which is a very difficult thing that a lot of people couldn't do with the mod because of how, well, I won't say broken, but let's just say because of how unoptimized the game was. That's just, you know, the, that version of the Armor 2 engine is just, a, it's a shocking engine, it really is. So, I do believe we are at Beloda. I haven't seen any zombies yet, which I'm happy about. Yep, we are at below the airfield. Groovy, expect to see other players. Just do a quick scan here. I'm not sure what those buildings are. They weren't there, I think. They don't actually look like they're meant to be there. I don't know. Do we have a map? Nope. V is vault. Thank you for doing that in the middle of the field. Oh, we do have a zombie. Right there. Uh, I have no idea what they're like, apart from the scattered footage we've seen. And you don't want to come across them because they're kind of broken. But that's fine. So we're going to take our chance here. Finally, it's gotten quiet. I just feel like I'm going to get shot. But, you know, the best thing about this game is the gunplay is shocking. So if I start getting shot at, all I need to do is just move very quickly. Oh, I may have just heard a noise then. Crank my volume up a bit in my head area. Oh, there's a flashlight over there. <laughs> Noob. You don't have to worry about people with flashlights. Because if they're using them, that means they're new. Which, that brings me to another thing, is there is going to be a lot of new players to this game. Because the mod wasn't exactly user-friendly. And not everybody can use it. And again, apology. No, fuck off! I have no idea who that is. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna have to turn that off. Oh, I have no idea who that is. Um, I saw the light come in the window. Then I was like, "Oh shit, there's a blowout." I am hearing things, but so I'm getting uh, tap worried. Now I'm hearing a V8 down the road. Red line it, mate. Um, I don't know if there's anybody in here. There's something in the corner here. I get. I was. What was I saying? Apologies if it's dark. There's nothing I can really do. So that was pretty simple. That was just middle mouse click, and we got ourselves some athletic shoes, which is what we have now. So we'll take them for gets and shiggles. Why not? And looks like we have. Something here I can't take. Oh, tear into rags. Okay, that's cool. We have lockers here, but I don't think they're interactable. The mouse smoothing is just immense. It's killing me. So there's our rags. Receiving? What do you mean receiving? I don't quite know what that means. We have a playlist. I just want to check what my ping is on the server here. Alright, pretty good. Pretty good. Let's get out of here, this place is giving me the creeps. So, I'm actually really surprised at um, the performance. I was expecting just shocking FPS. Right now, it's already better. What was that? Than 
standalone in terms of how it's being able to run and this was default set to most of it high and I'm not too sure I want to say if some of it was very high but right off the bat that is a good thing so I'm kind of happy and hopefully the keys are the same yep just want to put that on there just in case somebody comes tearing at me with an axe or something I can say I do not have my beans And right, I'm holding something, it seems. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, this... I, I don't know that. Oh, okay, that's area. Rider, so... I don't have any more... Inventory space, so we're going to clear this up, actually. We're going to drop some stuff. I'm wearing that. I wonder if I have... Damn it! No boobies! Alright. That's fine. So we've only seen one player so far. Then you bet your bottom dollar that they're over there somewhere. And there's no items, no loot whatsoever, really. <coughs> I'm choking on air here. Excuse me. Right. Let's go down here and get ourselves a shot. Shall not we? But yeah, I was super shocked to see this on the store, you know, because I usually keep up with Rocket on whatevers, and I didn't hear a word of it. Next minute, bam, there it is. Still got our head movement, which is good. Quite like it. I still don't think those buildings are meant to be there. They might have been spawned in my admin. Just for gets and shiggles. Oh. Oh dear. So, as you can clearly tell on the screen, we don't have any, um... I'll just tell you what I want to do. We don't have any of those eyeball things that lets us know if we're being spotted or any of that. Okay, so everything's on normal. I'll tell you what, shadows are something that I always disabled because they're quite broken. Whoa. Really? Clouds are generating light. That's strange. Terrain. Rendering. Anti-aliasing. Disabled. Ooh. That's not a good place to be dealing with that sort of thing. What I want to do is just have as many frames for you guys. Bloom off. That stuff's crap. Rotation blow off. Remember, this is alpha, so it's not going to run very nice for everybody else. And frames have tanked for no apparent reason. So maybe if we turn those to low. What did we turn up? Objects. Normal. That'll turn the blurriness off. Oh, look at that boost. From 25 to 45. Oh, shit, shit, shit. All right. Um, so this has just sort of started happening. All right, he just knocked that zombie out. And then we got back up. Looks like player syncing is quite buggy as you'd probably expect. And I don't know where this zombie is, probably just on the other side of this bush here. And that is a player. What we're gonna do is just completely stay out of its... Whoa! See that? It's punching. How do you punch? I don't have punch, do I? Player hands, and a battery, maybe I had to do that, attach. So, yeah, it seems that all character models are locked to female for now, for some strange reason. And I don't want to get my head bashed in with a torch. So we're just going to stay out of this person's way.
One thing I wish is it was daytime, obviously. Um, yeah. Uh, that person's preoccupied. We're going to take this opportunity, and for some reason, there we go, to just book it out of here. And what do you reckon we go out and check these buildings out, eh? So, it appears that we don't have the, um, the guy that can run many, many, many miles. We seem to have a, a thirst thing, uh, stanima, I'm guessing, exhaustion, all that sort of stuff, which means it's probably going to be worth investing in cars, teamwork, and all that sort of stuff. Which is different for DayZ because it just used to be plain old kill everybody on site. Which it's still going to be, but I think there's more incentive now. Sorry, I hope there's more incentive to um, start working together. So I hope there's something to these buildings up here, otherwise it's just going to be a waste of time. And we have Sprint. Very, very nice. With my manly voice as a woman. So these might actually be legitimate buildings here. I'm going to be shocked if they are because of where they are. Big apartment complexes on a hill behind an airport. But I wonder, tell you what, they look enterable. This might be a good place to get some loot. Frames tanking a little bit, sitting at about 27. If anybody's interested, my rig is a GTX Wind Force Overclocked 770, i7-3770. Crappy 8 gig of RAM and a standard hard drive. So it's not a BC rig by any stretch of the imagination, apart from the graphics card. But let's get in here, I think. And this place looks like it's friggin' bombed. But we can't go up. Oh, we can go up. Okay. Oh, I see. That's creepy. These doors don't look like they open. Let's go ahead and do whatever this is. Ah. So no clue where this is going to take us first. Oh, okay. So we get off here by the looks of it. Oh, this looks really not that stable. And that sounds like there's a zombie in here. Check the first level first. If there's a zombie in here, I'm probably going to have a heart attack. So, remember we need to start checking all these little loot piles and such. Under the bed, all that sort of stuff. But it looks like nothing's spawning. I haven't seen any loot, apart from a few rags and a pair of shoes. So this could be a server thing, or maybe there isn't actually any loot in the game yet. Because it was just released a few hours ago, so I, I don't think there's anything in the game. Which is a real shame. Let's get out of there. Um, I think what we'll do is we'll just go back down because I don't think there's anything in the game yet. So, you probably want me to go to Cherno, but... Oh god. Oh, okay. I'm hoping that's 
side chat because if that's direct chat, that means somebody close. Probably want me to go to Cherno. Or Tr uh, yeah, Cherno. But the problem with that is, is if I'm tanking because of the game now at 20 FPS, imagine what it's going to be like in Cherno. It's going to be a slideshow, basically. the butt end of a car over here somewhere. Here it is. Of course they're all going to be broken, so... Yeah, this is all new here. The, this was never here before. But the mouse is shocking. Absolutely shocking. I really do hope they fix that. Torches over there, I think. Those are hospitals. And I think this is. Well, I thought that was a barrack then. So I got no idea where to get loot from. supermarket okay if there's no loot in the supermarket uh, we know what's going on whoa oh it's obviously just a probably a fire so I'm hearing zombie sounds but I'm not seeing zombies so I'm gonna assume there's no zombies simple as that there's got to be loot oh there we go. Zombie, please don't come at me. I don't need whatever you're selling. So we have a backpack. Jesus. Oh, crowbar. Takey, takey, takey. Smacky, smacky. And so that's gone to one. We hit one. Boof. We now have... Melee. Which is better than nothing. And... Dunny paper. Oh, gas canister. Right, well, probably make a gun with that. And I just noticed. Yep, there's something on the thing there. Canned sardines, very nice. Looks like little bullets here. And 45 ACPs. Yeah, I'll take them. Make sure there's nobody sneaking up on me. What do you reckon we take this zombie on? They look to be a little bit broken at the moment. Ugh. So, I'm going to take him on. Oh. Just so you know, I don't have any ability whatsoever to heal myself. If I'm bleeding, I can feel... Oh, shit. Stay down, bitch! Please swing faster. So, melee is an absolute no-no don't get into it. I'm probably bleeding now, but I won't be able to do anything. Yeah, I'm bleeding. So, there's another supermarket here. I'm probably just going to die out. This is certainly not an actual playthrough, because the game just is not in a state where you can uh, attempt to play properly. So, got a bit of a kitchen knife there. That makes no sense whatsoever. A water bottle here. So don't get into fights with zombies. That's a no-no. More sardines and looks like we've got maybe a clip here or something. Seven six two. Ooh. Oh, oh, wait a second, ladies and gentlemen. We might be able to survive this now. 
I can't. Did that do anything to my character or no? I don't quite know what receiving means. I don't know what to do with this. I think... Maybe... Aha! Is that a... That's a bandage. Aha! So... You have to put the med bag in your hands and then that gives you all of these ah me lucky what I see now I'm no longer bleeding excellent so any kind of PvP or PvE at the moment is not recommended at all unless of course you have a gun then go nuts but yeah, don't try and smack a zombie because he wins. Let's just run up here for now. And I don't know if I'm hungry or whatever. I know there's little messages that pop up in the bottom left, but I'm just not paying enough attention. That's my fault, of course. Still have to walk upstairs, which is kind of annoying. But, um... Alright, let's be slightly careful here. Cautious. Oh, and the mouse, I'm telling you guys, is absolutely shocking. They really need to fix this. Uh, I think I first saw this building in Epoch, maybe. Oh, what? Winter Hunter Pants. Ooh. Fashionable. So there is loot. I take all that back. But it's definitely not everywhere. Brown hoodie. Tell you what, let's wear me a brown hoodie. So, vicinity is your local area, basically. The little piles around you. That's pretty cool. Definitely gives you enough room to notice what's going on. Blue checkered shirt. just heard rustling or footsteps out there so now this is a medical wall here a med box on a wall why can I know rip that off loot the shit out of it so yeah I just heard something out there and again I'm gonna hope that's ambient noise which some of it's still the same from whoa what am I opening? I don't know what I'm opening there. So I'm at 19 FPS right now. This is really painful. But again, alpha. It's not going to be optimized. And of course I am recording, so... It's not going to be that great. Let's go first person. So we can see what we're doing. Oh, what was that? Can we take paper, can we? Why not? I want to drink something. Well, ooh, 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 ooh. Raider cap. Red one. Nice. Stylish. So, screw with this running shit. If we get into a fight with somebody, I'm probably going to lose because, well... Unless they're close to trying to punch me. Because I'm pretty sure that I would, in fact, hurt more when using a crowbar than they would using fists, but we don't know at this point. Is that a gas mark? Oh. Another beanie. Beanie beanie. And end of the line. Now I don't know. I seem to have mucked me buttons up here. There we go. If these doors can be opened. No, probably not. So let's continue going up. Ooh, a sodium machine. A 
This place looks like a friggin' bomb hit it. Ooh, a baseball bat. I want. Ooh, ooh, okay, we can have multiple melee weapons on a hotbar. Excellent. Oh, that was the close icon, so I have no idea what I'm opening and closing. End of the line. Let's go up another level. It's probably going to be a long video, just an introduction sort of thing. Just to show you where the game's at, in terms of quality. My stomach grumbles, so does mine actually. I'm going to get food after this. It looks like we have an EpiPen, maybe, Morphine Auto Injector, something very important, very familiar with the other ones. And chips. Tell you what, let's have a feed, shall we? So this is one thing that I know of. Yeah, you see, so we can't do anything with stuff. So we have to drag into our hotbar and go four. And I think we... How do we eat? Oh, we need a can opener or a knife. Yeah. Damn. All right. So we'll put that back in our inventory somehow. Um, I don't quite know how to take things out, but surely we can eat some crisps. Eat raw, oh, it's raw cereal. Oh, we all used to do that as a kid, right? No, I'm 60%. Eat, 40%, okay. Nom, 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 nom. Surely there's nothing bad can come from eating raw cereal. I mean, I am. Oh, okay, that's a little bit weird. I am satisfied, apparently. So let's get a lay of the land here. Don't see anybody else on the buildings? But it doesn't look like there's anybody. Up here. And the zombies doing the moonwalk over there and whatnot. Coming and going, mate. What are you doing? Alright. Well, I tell you what. I think I'm going to end it here. Um, now, I'm going to continue recording straight after this. And I will upload it just a few hours after this one. And by that I mean because it might take a while. But um, we're going to continue playing this. So guys, hope you enjoyed it. Remember, it's on Steam. There will be a link in the description, of course, to the store page. Um, at the moment, yeah, it's it's a it's a, it's an alpha, and they had to practically rewrite most of it. So I think they're doing all right for now. Anyway, take care, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.